Istanbul, a city where the past and present converge in breathtaking harmony. Its enchanting landscapes and captivating allure beckon travelers from across the globe. From majestic minarets that pierce the sky to the sparkling water of the Bosphorus, Istanbul is a treasure trove of architectural marvels and natural wonders. Every corner whispers tales of empires, cultures, and tradition. Yet, amidst the vibrant energy of this metropolis, there's a sanctuary of simplicity and comfort, a place where your journey is made easy. The Peacock Clinic, your trusted partner in the heart of Istanbul. Today we will host Dr. Steven Snyder, a board-certified dermatologist and cosmetic laser surgeon from Maryland. We have documented the entire procedure and received his honest opinion on our clinic. Hey, Dr. Schneider, really great to have you here today. Thank you very much. I'm really excited to be here. Dr. Schneider, why don't you tell us a little bit about yourself, uh, where you're from, what it is that you do? Okay. Well, I am Dr. Steve Snyder. I'm a board certified dermatologist and cosmetic laser surgeon. My office is in Owings Mills, Maryland. It's called the Dermatology Laser Center and Medi Spa. I've been in practice for about 36 years now. In fact, we just celebrated our anniversary just a couple of weeks ago. We're very excited about that. Congrats. Thank you. And you do hair transplants yourself? I do. I do. Really? How many uh, procedures have you done? Well, we've done many hundreds of them over the years, and it's really exciting. But in the United States, they tend to separate the hairs a little further apart. And many times patients have to end up getting like two procedures, even three sometimes, in order to get the density. And that's one of the things that attracted me about the Peacock Clinic because you do this advanced DHI procedure where you really compact the hairs and it's possible to get 4,500 grafts in one procedure. Exactly, exactly. So is, is that really what got you to come to Turkey over here? It really is, because I had a hair transplantation done two years ago for myself. I, I didn't do it myself. I had another doctor come in and do it. And I really wasn't impressed with the result. I felt that my hairline just wasn't low enough. I felt he didn't bring it in on the sides. And I only ended up getting like 1,800 grafts. I was expecting to get a lot more at the time. Wow, wow. I wanted to look younger, and hair makes you look younger. I mean, there's no question about it. Uh, you take the same person's face and with hair, and you remove the hair, you know, and it, using a nap that takes away hair. They look years and years older. You add hair to somebody that looks so much younger. You bring down a hairline, you bring in the, the sides, you look so much younger, and that's what I'm after. Awesome, the teeth and the neck look great. The face looks really Thank wonderful. Thank you, thank you very much. I'm sure uh, you're really looking forward to this procedure considering you've done your research, you, you do this, you're a hair transplant doctor, and this is what you wanted, the advanced DHI. What are your expectations for the outcome here? Well, after having researched the clinic very thoroughly, finding out that you've done over 20,000 procedures, that you've got over a 98% success rate, knowing which doctors are doing the procedure and the technicians that you have, having seen results, and knowing that Turkey is one of the top places in the world to get a hair transplant done. This is really what drew me to the clinic, and my expectations are to get great results. I'm, I'm sure we won't disappoint. Welcome to the BHT facility, a 19-story smart cosmetic hospital. Within the heart of the BHT, you'll find the Peacock Clinic, your trusted partner for a seamless journey to self-confidence. So Dr. Snyder, what did you think of Istanbul so far? Amazing city. It's, it's really beautiful and it's got a great history. It was amazing to see the Blue Mosque. It was amazing to see the, the Hagia Sophia. It was incredible, we saw from the outside. I'd like to see it inside. And uh, we went on a boat and we were actually on the Bosphorus Strait, and that was the point that actually is uh, dividing the city of, of uh, Istanbul. And to one side, you see Asia, and the other side is Europe, which, which to me was phenomenal. See that? Great. Very beautiful. And the bridge was incredible, and the photographs that I got were amazing. Good. I've already put stuff on my Instagram for it, so I'm very proud of it. I'll be sure to check that out. Do you, what's your Instagram, by the way? My Instagram is Dr. Laser Baltimore, D R L A S E R Baltimore. The operation has been two days now. It's been two days since. Uh, how are you feeling? 
It's really incredible. The recovery has been absolutely amazing. I was expecting to have a lot of swelling on my face. I've had this procedure done actually two years ago. I had an FUT procedure done, but I had the same process basically where the slits were made in my head uh, prior to receiving the grafts and the grafts were implanted about an hour and a half later after they were processed through a microscope. And this process is so much better, so much quicker. There's a greater survival rate, as I understand, with, with the hairs with that, because the longer the hairs are out of your scalp, the more time that, that uh, it takes for them to get back in your head, the greater the risk of losing the hairs because you lose the viability of them. And with this process, with the DHI, which stands for direct hair implantation, the hairs are actually implanted at the very moment that the slits are inserted into your scalp. So there's a lot less bleeding, there's a lot less pain uh, after the procedure, and a lot less swelling. And I was looking back at pictures of me from two years ago, my eyes were all puffed out. Tremendous swelling on my face uh, the day after, and the next day, and the next day. And you can see this is like two days after you can see. I don't have any swelling at all in my face. It's, it's amazing. Uh, Pain-wise, I have none. Absolutely no pain at all, which is incredible. Good. No pain in the back, no pain on the top, no pain anywhere. So one of the things that always attracted me about seeing results from Turkey is that the hair transplants are done in such a way that the hairs are compacted so much more closely. And it's very typical in this country to implant 4,000, 5,000 or more grafts. Whereas in the US, most of the time patients are getting 2,000, 3,000 and they end up having to have a second treatment, which I have had to come back for a second treatment myself. But I believe that if I'd had my treatment done originally here, it would have been one treatment, it would have been a one and done, and I would have had the results that, that I was expecting. I have had uh, tremendous compaction of the, of the hair follicles in the front of the scalp. The hairline is, has been lowered, which I'm so happy about, and the density is so much better than I had before. I already know being a, a, a surgeon myself who does hair transplantation, the results are incredible. I'm, I'm really looking forward to it. We're looking forward to it too, Dr. Yeah. Snyder. Awesome, awesome. What did you think about the staff here that have worked with you today and the other day? I didn't realize that I was gonna be treated actually in, in a modern hospital, which was very comforting. From the very moment that I arrived at the building, the very modern hospital, VHT, you have plastic surgery, you have general surgery, OBGYN, you have every everything that you would expect to see in a major hospital. And the Peacock Clinic is, is one portion in that hospital. So it's very comforting to know that I was in a hospital having this done rather than just in some little office. So that was, that was really helpful to know that that was, that was going to be the case. From the very moment that, uh, you know, I, that I was picked up from the airport, I had VIP service brought in by, by limo to the hotel, uh, three nights in the hotel, which was part of the deal with, with the uh, Peacock Clinic was great. Five-star hotel, accommodations are great. The food has really been great. Everybody at the hotel has been great. And then I was picked up by, by limo. The lim a Mercedes limo has taken me back and forth to the Peacock Clinic and uh, it's been awesome. I do this procedure a lot in my own office, so I'm very familiar with what was gonna happen uh, from start to finish. But I was so impressed with the professionalism that you have, with the, with the uh, assistants, with the hair technicians, and with the doctor doing the procedure. It was really great. I, was, I felt that all of my questions were answered. I was especially uh, concerned in the beginning that I would get the hairline that I wanted and expressed all of my concerns and the doctor explained everything perfectly, drew it all out. I was able to look at the proposal in advance to see exactly where the hairline was going to be, exactly what I wanted, and everything happened exactly the way I wanted. So I couldn't be more happy. I, I highly, highly recommend the Peacock Clinic to anyone in the U.S. that is considering to get a hair transplant uh, done in Turkey. This is the place to come to. They are so professional and everybody's nice. You're a great person. This guy's great. Everybody's been great. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Really means a lot, Steve. So, in doing the FUE procedure in my own practice, we typically have two or three hair technicians that are actually doing the implantations afterwards. I'm in involved in 
performing all of the local anesthesia in advance, as well as doing all of the um, slits that are, that are the uh, recipient sites. And I'm also doing all the numbing that's, that's done in advance. But my technicians are responsible for doing the implantation of the follicles after they've been processed. And it usually takes three women, two and three hours to, to do, let's say 2,500 uh, grafts. So I was so impressed with how quickly this DHI procedure is because it's like virtually one second passes between the taking of the follicle and implanting it. And I, I had a video taken uh, for my own purposes that I could watch what was being done afterwards. And I looked at it in the hotel room and I'm watching, he's taking the follicle and this goes in, it's one second, another second goes by, it's another one and then another one and then another one. It is so fast. And in half the time, I got 4,150 grafts, which, which just was so amazing to me in comparison to the way it's done in the U.S. So very happy here. Awesome. You know, Steve, you've been such a great, great patient for us. Uh, you really understand the entire process and you really were able to appreciate every step along the way because you know how this is done. You've done it yourself and you've had it done. Uh, you're able to appreciate the difference and the quality and the expertise we have really in getting this done right. Couldn't agree more. 100% agreement. Awesome. Awesome. Well, Steve, thank you so much. It's been great having you, brother. Thank you very much, Omar.